Here are some other headlines we're following for you tonight. Right now, police in Lovejoy are searching for the man accused of killing his wife. Officers say Ikuko Thurman shot his wife multiple times on Friday. Police discovered Terry Livingston Jett in the front seat of her car after it crashed into a mailbox. And investigators say their daughter saw the whole thing go down. Lovejoy police say do not approach Thurman. He's considered armed and dangerous. Jury selection in the trial against the law enforcement officers accused of killing a man in East Point has now been postponed. Christopher Hutchins and Eric Hines are accused of shooting Jamarian Robinson 59 times while serving a warrant in 2016. Attorneys for the officers have argued their case should be heard in federal court because Robinson was shot while a U.S. Marshals Task Force was serving a warrant on behalf of a local police department. If the trial goes to federal court, officers would plan to seek immunity as federal officers. It's a move the Fulton County DA is objecting to. We are learning more details about the death of a former Braves player who retired to become a New York, New Jersey Port Authority police officer. Anthony Vavaro was on his way to serve at the World Trade Center Command for a 9-11 event when a wrong way driver hit him head on, killing him. Vavaro is survived by his wife and four children. A GoFundMe page has been set up for the 37-year-old. We have a link to it on 11alive.com.